I'm here to show you how to wire in a motor into a Captain 6. I ran the cord in through the, the door. This is not how you would do in real life, but for, for the sake of the argument, this was real easy. Got to wire it in. And just close. The motor runs. So open, runs the other way. This motor is running. If it goes too hard, this little breaker will pop out, or I can pull it out and it'll stop. These little fuses protect the motors from going too hard. The motor stops, always come check the fuse. Again, I'm showing you how to connect the motor to the Captain 6. Bring your motor leads in and connect it right here. To terminals 1 and 2, if it's set up for relays 1 and 2. And that's all there is to the connecting a motor. You do have to make sure that this cord stays shorter than 200 feet. There's a limitation how far the motor can be from the control box. So you've got to be within about 200 feet. And then the rest of these contacts are available for heaters or fans.